Hi friends. Today we will learn how to create angle effect in PowerPoint. This effect is useful when teaching mathematics. Let us learn how to create this animation. We can spin arrow in PowerPoint, but it's not rotating as an angle. See this one, it's rotating as an angle. For creating this, we will take an additional shape along with this arrow shape. First we need to take oval shape. Draw oval shape holding the shift key so that we get the correct aspect ratio. Now let us keep the oval in the center. We can use a line to keep the shape in the middle of the slide. We need to draw an arrow along with the oval shape. For this, we need to enable guides. From view tab, now we can use these grid lines to keep oval in the middle and also draw other shapes. Now let us take an arrow. And draw the arrow shape starting from the middle point of the oval shape to any one end of the oval shape. Overall concept of this animation is to group the arrow with oval shape and spin the group. Now let us change the arrow width and color. Arrow shout start from the center to end of the oval shape. Now let us group the oval and arrow by selecting both with Ctrl plus A on the keyboard or select by holding the control key. Then press Ctrl plus G for grouping. Or use group from format tab. Now it's a group. This is the first step of creating a group with oval and arrow shapes. We can select the group by clicking it. Let us give animation to it. For this, we need to select the group and give spin effect from animation's emphasis. Background also rotating. We will remove the fill of background.
If the arrow not in the corset position, then the oval shaped spin looks odd. For this, we need to move the arrow into the correct position. Now let us hide the oval shape. By clicking the group then clicking again on the oval shape. Then in the format. Take shape fill to no fill. And take shape outline to no outline. Now we can see only arrow shape. The spin effect is 360 degrees and in clockwise. Let us change these. For example, if we want to show 90 degrees, select the group. And click animation tab. And click animation pane. In the animation pane, Double click on group 4. Now we need to change direction and amount. Direction to counterclockwise. Amount to custom 90 degrees. Let us check it once. Yes, this is what we want. Let us make another copy of this. and change the angle to 45 degrees. Let us see the animation once again. If we want to resize the arrow, we need to select entire group and resize holding the shift. Let us see the animation once again. This is how we can create angle animation effect in PowerPoint. We have attached an arrow to the circle oval shape and giving spin effect to the group. For showing the angle I have used arc shape and animated along with the first animation. Hope this is useful to you. Please like, share and subscribe for more videos like this. Thank you.